Good afternoon. Art and I are working on attempting to setting up some grow lights and we've been talking about light fixtures. You need that rinsed? Yes. All right. I've been doing a fair amount of research on grow lights and how they work and everything like that. And instead of spending the money on something, I don't really want to buy a whole setup because I'm not sure this is something we want to do permanently. Sorry, talking and washing with one hand isn't quite as fast as having two sets of hands rinsing out the rag. So I did a lot of reading over the weekend and it seems like what the plants need are um, different light waves, however you want to call them, usually red and blue. And you can get that through fluorescent lights as long as you get a cool fluorescent light and then a warm fluorescent light. And what I'm looking for, well, I'll just show you guys. I'm looking for something that I can actually hang in the greenhouse. So I'm not taking up any extra room. And I think this, when I measured this out, this was two feet across. And they do sell two foot fluorescent light fixtures. So I'm thinking that either if Art can figure out something to hook up to here. If not here, hang it on this lower rack and then we'll just put the plants down here. And then just get some, um, get a red light bulb and a blue light bulb, um, just the hues that they give off. And we'll see how that works with our plants. This is sort of experimental, but Art said, I think I have some of those light fixtures down in the basement. And lo and behold, he actually had three. Now, one was in a spot that we actually had two light fixtures. So that one we were able to, um, repurpose for our use here and that's what art is doing right now we're just um, because it was in the basement it was really dusty it had a lot of sawdust from all the kitchen construction so he's just cleaning that off for a little bit and then we're gonna attempt to hang it up get some light bulbs and see what those plants think of that the other thing that I, the re websites reminded me was plants really benefit from a good fertilizer now my fertilizer that one of you guys had sent me two years ago is actually out in the barn so I think I'm gonna go out that go out there grab that and start adding that to my watering mixture because I know in past years that seems to be the key and I had forgotten about it so I'm hoping that with these two um, solutions our plants will thrive a little bit more and we can get some good lettuce and spinach going in the house before summertime well spring and summertime come we are down and I'm down in the basement and I ask our where the s hooks are and he said to come downstairs into the, well, not quite so scary basement. And he thinks he knows where they are. And he gave me directions. I'll see how good I can follow directions. See if I can. All right, I think this is the little shelf he directed me to. He said there was piles and piles of S-hooks. Now, I'm not seeing piles and piles of S-hooks yet. But I'm going to keep looking because that's a chain. It looks like you'd be that looks like all screws. Oh, S hooks. Nails. This is probably a uh, guy's delight. If any guys are watching this, you're probably loving looking through all his tools like this. To me, this is a lot of dirt and um, dust. But all right, maybe here. Oh, no, not there. All right, Art, I'm not having success. Okay, let's see if I can have a little better success. We just organized it, and that makes it harder to find things for a little while until you <laughs> get it figured out. Um, let's see. You said there was lots and lots and lots of S-hooks. Lots so and lots and lots. Somewhere. I was, I was looking for the lots and lots and lots of S-hooks. Yes. I was hoping they'd jump at me, but well, those are... look like all nails. I'm guessing well, it's not in the nail section. Let's see here. Where did they Are they over here somewhere? They might be. That's what happens when you, when you organize. organize. You don't find anything. Oh, else. maybe over here. That's probably right here. Whoa! Oh, it's a little dark over here. It's a little okay. dark. Hmm. Oh, is it a bassoon body lock? <laughs> no, it's not a bassoon body lock. Is this the pile of? Let's see. Oh, you know what? We need one of these for the stool upstairs. I'm going to put that in my okay. pocket. <laughs> you know what it reminds me of? What? Is this the place where Kitty oh, belongs yes, and Karen's right. in? No, no, no! It's like the S-hooks yeah, here. Yeah, Karen and the little S-kitten. Is this where the... 
as hooks are, and the kitty said, no, no, no. Yeah, you can never <laughs> find things when you first organize, so then you have to get used to your new setup, and then you can find things. That them? Uh, it feels like it might be. I have to open up the bag. Let's see. Uh, uh, nope. Those don't look those like, like as hooks. What are these? These are little hinges. Oh, like those automatic yeah, closing? closing hinges. I think they're in here somewhere. One more drawer. No, no, no. Look at this one. I found hooks at least. Those are the screw in ones. Now we need the S hook ones. No. Let's see. There. Oh, there we go. That's what we're looking for. See, I knew I had them somewhere. Probably these little ones will do. Will the chain fit on that? Um, yes. Okay. That's okay. handy. Don't have to go to the hardware store. That's right. Save a trip to the hardware store. Dad, can uh, I see the marble? I gave it to John. Can I see the marble? Would you, like, help Art? Um, can I see it? Can you do that? Okay. Charity, can you come here? Look what it says in Just hold up the light picture. On that yeah, end. Okay, I just hook these two okay, together. And that will help. There we go. Will yeah. that hold? Yes, it will hold. Sure? Okay. Okay, no, this one fell off, but I think it's still That's good. together. Okay. Good. On this side, all you can see was the one hook. Go. Okay, go right. okay, it's not quite level. I need to loosen Where's, this one up a little. Where are you going to um, are we going to put the plants right below it, underneath it? Because they need to be very near it. Oh, well, I... Um, or do you want to just drop that down? We could drop it down. We have that bar. We can take the bar out. And now we'll just even yes. it out. Yeah, I think we have ourselves a grow light. Right, so now we just need to get the light bulbs, the right colored ones. And then mm -hmm. we're good to go. Okay, I guess that looks reasonably level. Yep. We got our power cord. And we have our extension cord. Yeah. We got it all set up and the light is on. And the little plants are growing. Hey Janelle, this is about as exciting as watching plants grow. Yeah, we all exciting. I found it and we'll start feeding the plants this. I'm excited. I'm gonna do three of them. Grow, little plants, grow. Grow as fast as you can, Noah. Maybe we'll eat it soon. Wouldn't that be yummy? Yeah, Daddy made them for me. Daddy and you planted these for Mommy, didn't you? Yum, yum, yum. Well, the next thing is we might have to move them into their own pots. This one way to get kids to eat vegetables, if you have problems with that, we don't, but we know a lot of people do, uh, have them grow their own, because then they'll want to eat them. Yeah, we like eating our own. One time I made my own with mommy, and I planted them. I made two, one, two plants of them. Putting them back oh, under the light. All fed. And it's not very shiny today. Oh, the sun just came out though. It's uh, kind of a gray day today, so that's why we're using the lights on a on a regular day. Ooh. Look at we're getting more lemon flowers. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we have to start using our lemons. We have a whole yep, bunch of ready. whole bunch of lemons. That new orange flower is coming. Once these oranges ripen, then this thing's gonna get a haircut. Right. Yeah, we have uh, one ripe orange, uh, a few others not quite ripe yet, but we've eaten most of them. And Mary loves the oranges here. They're really tart. They are. They're very tart and they're good. And also, Sandy, how we make this for me. Really? Uh-huh. <laughs> we have a sad little girl here. Do you know what happened? She touched the DVD player. <laughs> Okay, okay, it's about two minutes later and she's finally quieted down. She 
push the, the button on the DVD player and the door <laughs> opened. <laughs> yeah, I shouldn't be laughing, but anyway, it scared her so bad that she, she dropped down and crawled away really fast. As you can tell, it's time for dinner, but I'm not going to show you what we're having today because there are lots of odds and ends and this and that. We just cleaned out the refrigerator. And the pantry. Right, yeah. <laughs> it was a clean out refrigerator and pantry day today.